bananas if you say peppers and you guys i might be getting sick so i'm gonna open these as a little treat to myself um because you guys supposedly there are new mini brands out there um before i went on vacation i saw a video pop up for me and it was like the series for wave two mini brands and it's supposed to have a bunch of like i literally was like is this even real okay um because it looks like this next wave like i must have not been paying attention on the chart at all because this person pulling out miniature scotch tape miniature paper clips and then they open the container and there's actual like little tiny paper clips inside. So yeah, um, basically the person I saw and I cannot remember their name now. I'm so sorry. It was like a channel I've never seen before, but I was like, this video is amazing. Um, they said that they found the new ones in the four pack that they got from Target. And there was a specific serial number. Did I remember that serial number though? No, um, but I actually bought these in Target in Louisiana um, because before we went to Disney, we stayed in New Orleans for a little bit. And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna try my luck here. Maybe I'll have better luck than buying them in Texas. I don't know why I thought that. I was like, um, New Orleans sounds like, well, actually I got these in Lafayette, I think, um, on, the, on the way to New Orleans. But uh, these feel like kind of oddly, moist on the inside um but yeah and then the other thing is is i also saw on youtube i did not click on the video but i saw somebody have series five mini brands is that a thing i would be really shocked if that was real already because i feel like series four has not been out there's something rolling around in the ball. How strange. Uh, yeah, I feel like we haven't had series four for that long. You guys, this is not wanting to open. We're going to try another section first. Yes, you guys. Oh my God. These are like, oh, look at this. It's a little baby Slurpee. <gasps> That's so cute. I'm like, honestly, kind of shocked that this is not in um what was it called the ones that uh melissa cheap chick opened that were the foodie mini brands <gasps> no cash um i should have held on to that chart but we do have wapas now i feel like it's been so long um since i've unboxed mini brands somehow um that i don't even remember these all seem new to me Anyway, I didn't even finish this thought, you guys. I feel like sometimes when I feel like I'm gonna get sick, I become even more scatterbrained than I usually am. So watch out, world. Um, but I feel like since this is a 7-Eleven kind of more restaurant, 7-Eleven is a restaurant in my mind, um, then I'm shocked it's not like in the foodie ones with like Subway and stuff. Oh my God, this is so cute. I feel like we did get this one, but I love it so much. Um, Arm & Hammer, Clean & Simple, Laundry Detergents. And then, oh my God, are we right back at the super difficult one? Ooh, a gold one. Gold, OxyClean. Um, I think that this is my first series four gold mini brand or like a uh, special one at all. Rare, you guys. Uh, somebody tell me like a fun series or something that I should start watching in case I get sick. Um, and we've got Cheez-Its, which oddly enough for me, this for some reason feels like it's a way older mini brand that was in like series three or something. I don't see any of this stationary stuff on the back, which maybe that should tell me something. Um, next time I get a chart, I'm not just gonna like throw it. Um, but yeah, ball number two, you guys. I need to try and find that video again and look at the specific. The only thing I remember is I think they said it, it was balls that was manufactured in December or later. Um, but yeah, I thought this would be fun. You guys, I've like honestly been bit by the stationary bug 
Um, I want to make more stationary videos. I feel like I go through like phases where I'm like all my videos are either like one type of video or the other. So yeah, I was like just so excited when I saw teeny tiny little baby paper clips. You guys, if y'all are into Elvis, comment that down below. Let me know of like a good Elvis documentary. I feel like somehow, gosh dang, duplicate already. I feel like somehow I started going down the Elvis rabbit hole. It's like yesterday on TikTok for you page, like it started showing me all these random clips from these super old like BBC interviews or something. And I was like, oh my God, this is like kind of fascinating. So I want like a really good documentary, you know? Um, juicy juice. This seems both familiar and new. I feel like I went on some kind of like juicy juice talking spree like many, many videos ago because I used to love juicy juice when I was a kid, but the packaging was so much cuter. Like, oh my God. I like, I really don't like how everything has gone so minimalistically. You guys, look, it's like normal OxyClean. Once again, I'm not even finishing my own thoughts, but like, do you know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like they could have done like some more imaginative packaging. Like when I drank Juicy Juice, it had funny, cute little faces on it. Um, so this is kind of interesting because I swear the gold OxyClean is just slightly larger than the regular OxyClean, but it's like kind of funny how we're like, getting nearly the same things. Um, two out of five have been like literally the same thing. Um, okay, here's the chart. We're gonna take a look at that really quick. Hershey's Milk Chocolate Bar. Yummy, yummy. Um, although I had a friend, he told me that literally Hershey's chocolate tastes like, what did he say? He said it tastes like rotten cheese or something to him. There's like quite a barely a whole group of people that think like, Hershey's chocolate or something like tastes really bad. Um, which I have to say, I just like don't like milk chocolate. I much prefer like dark chocolate. Like I just honestly, um, yeah, I honestly like don't really like milk chocolate at all. It's like very, very rare. It definitely has to have like a lot of like fillings or toppings or something for me to like milk chocolate. Um, but yeah, oh my God, you guys look at all of these art supplies that I missed post-it notes, scotch tape, um, a two pack of scissors. Um, and then like, what is that? Watercolors, the, um, paper clips I keep talking about. So it's definitely a thing. How did I never ever see those before? But you guys, I'm starting to lose faith that these are the new balls. Um, we do have frosted flakes though. Uh, and I feel like we've gotten that before, but I could be wrong. All right, you guys, ball number three. Um, I don't know why I just thought like, mm, yeah, four pack at Target. These must be the new ones. Like why, why would I assume that? Um, also I feel like, although I did get these in Louisiana, I feel like a lot of times Texas is like the last place to get like the newest stuff. Um, I don't know why that is, but I feel like snacks and stuff, especially because I love to try like the new random like cereal flavors or the coffee cream flavors or something like that. But I'll see like pages on Instagram or something who are in like, I don't know, New Jersey, let's say. And like they will get these items like six months in store, like before I can find them anywhere at all in Texas. So I feel like unless it's like a Dr. Pepper product or something, like we're gonna be waiting forever. So maybe I should revisit this in like, I don't know, a couple months, when series five comes out. Okay, I finally got it open. This one took a really long time. Ah! Um, oh, what is this? Oh, it's the credit card machine. Again, we've definitely gotten this like many, many times now. Um, and I feel like I filmed a video for this, but I don't remember if I actually edited it yet. Um, I got some uh, Gashpon that was credit card machines and those were super cute, but shockingly the cards were still 
paper cards. I was like, oh my god. Um, fruit and yogurt special K cereal. I feel like this is different. Wouldn't that be magical if like Target Online or something just let you pick where you wanted to order the mini brands from? I would pick like, I want to order mini brands from New York or something. Um, because I feel like that happens. Like, I feel like uh, I've gotten a lot of comments from y'all in the past that say that, like, sometimes they'll send certain mini brands and, like, certain waves of mini brands to, like, different parts of the country and stuff, which is really fascinating. But I kind of feel like these are the most repeat ones we've ever had. Yeah, look, another Slurpee. Like, this is wild. I kind of feel like this is the most repeats I've ever gotten in one of these four packs. Um, and I'm gonna have to argue that this is still just original wave one. Um, oh my god. Oh, we finally got our first little stack of cash. A uh, $10 little stack of cash. So cute. You guys know these are some of my favorites. Now if I get the little sack of coins, I will be so excited. Um, and then this is, oh, I think these were some of the candies because I also said um, I feel like for Series 4 they combined some of the ones that they were doing in the UK with some of them here in the States because some of the brands, like I think it was Vimto and stuff, um, I think it is like a brand um, that's in the UK. And I think we can get it here at like World Market and stuff where they've got, um, you know, like snacks and food and stuff from all over the world. Um, and then this candy we got before, which is called Swizzles. And I think I looked that up and I'm pretty sure that's also like a UK candy. So you guys, um, no miniature stationary stuff, I guess, which is kind of sad because I could have used some teeny tiny little paper clips. I was like, oh my God, I could like use those for real in my Hobonichi planner and I would have been over the moon. I would have been so excited. Um, oh my gosh, you guys, I think I'm gonna do like an everything shower. Well, probably like an everything shower light tonight. Um, but I think I'm gonna do like my facial steamer. And once again, I can't open that, you guys. Oh my God. And I actually drank all of my water. I need more. Mm. Okay, what is this? What is this? Holy, holy guacamole classic minis. Oh my God, this is so cute. I feel like I've never seen this in store now that has definitely happened to me before where i get something in here and i'm like tempted to try and find it in store i'm trying to remember what cereal it was and then i really started to actually love it um pure baking soda arm and hammer now i feel like this looks familiar because i feel like i asked y'all this before i feel like i've never seen baking soda in any other package besides like the ye old like box so this is like pretty interesting and let's see i think we just have three sections left oh my god this must be another shelf have we gotten the shelf before i think we did i'm trying to remember what's the other thing oh yeah we i think we have not gotten a single shopping cart which is so weird because I remember like the very first series of these. Like you got a shopping cart or a hand basket in every single ball. <gasps> Yay! Oh my god, I saw this on the back of the packaging and I thought it was so cute. But I've personally never seen this brand, Billy B Honey. Honey? Does this say Honey Miel? <laughs> Y'all, I don't even know what that is. I, I just don't have the culinary knowledge for these sometimes. I have like Whataburger food knowledge. Um, so once again, I'm not sure if this is a brand from the UK, but I thought this was so adorable. Like the little honeybee honey packaging. Like I thought it was just like plain honey. I like literally do not know what honey meal is. I have to like look that up. Maybe it's a more concentrated form of honey or something. 
Um, and you guys, only one stack of cash. This is kind of crazy. Uh, Bomb Burrito. We got these before. I'm trying to remember if we got this specific fragrance. This is not a fragrance. Um, this specific flavor. Uh, beef, beef, bean, and cheese sauce. So once again, I feel like I did look for these before because I talked about, um, wow, these like look and sound good and I've never seen them before. But then again, you guys, most of the time we go grocery shopping at HEB and I feel like HEB is like, it's like a Texas only grocery store. And I love HEB, but sometimes I feel like they're more limited on like national brands, if that makes any sense. Like a lot of times when I'm looking for specialty flavors of like coffee creamer or whatever, I have to go to Kroger's because they're like a national store. So I feel like they get more like random stuff, if that makes any sense. Whereas HEB has a lot of like special items too, but a lot of times they're just like literal like Texas things, like things made in Texas, <laughs> like brands and food stuff that's like made in Texas. Uh, so yeah, I feel like they don't have bomb burrito, but it looks good. Anyway, you guys, rambling as always. So yeah, I feel like I am gonna have to like try and find that video again, try and find the certain serial number, and just more carefully look for that serial number before I try and buy these again so we don't get a lot of repeats. I feel like I started off being super excited today because I feel like I was like, whoa, like the Slurpee, the golden one we got, that was pretty cool, and the bee, my favorite one. Um, but then I feel like these were probably the most repeaty ones uh, that we've ever had. So that was a little bit disappointing. But anyway, you guys, uh, let me know if y'all have found any of the mini stationary items in mini brands. I feel like that would be so, so fun. Oh my God. Uh, so yeah, the quest will continue. Um, but maybe when I can like more closely look at the serial number. Anyway, you guys, thank y'all so, so much for hanging out with me today and for watching. If you're not already and you'd like to be, hit the button down below, subscribe, become a member of the Banana Pepper Squad today. And until I see you guys again, which is gonna be very, very soon, stay happy, stay healthy, stay sassy, stay banana peppery. I love you guys so, so much and I'll see you again very soon. Bye.